Greetings and salivations, everyone. I'm Krista. This is Fisher. Welcome to Sea Rad. The real effects stitch puppet is here. I know. I'm so excited. So we're going to give you an up close look at him and show you how he works. So stay tuned. Sea Rad. Hi, everybody. Well, hello, 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 everyone. Welcome. We hope everyone's doing totally rad today. How awesome is this? <laughs> I know. I am really, really excited. I've been excited for this for a while now, and he's here. He's finally here. So, Stitch Real Effects Puppet by WoW Stuff. We are going to take him out of the box, give you an up-close look at him, show you how he works and all the cool things he does, or hopefully does, and of course, rate him on our scale of totally bad to totally rad. So Fisher, I'm definitely going to have to set you to the side. You good with that? I'm good with that. All right, my little dude. Boop. We will see you in a little bit. So, real effects, Stitch. How stinking adorable is this guy? I love it. He comes in this really cool collector's box. It's plastic, like a hard plastic on the bottom. And then it's like a, you know, like a display window plastic that they used to have on action figures on the front to make it look like he's in his little capsule. He has a hundred plus sound and movement combinations. So he is a working puppet. He's real effects. So he does make sounds also. So I I'm really excited to get him out of the box. He's in here pretty good. And this box is a collector's box and it's a display box. So when you take it apart, you don't have to tear it to get into him. There's just a couple of different things that we need to do to get it out of here. So I see it looks like these are like screws almost on the top. And they are. So you just turn that screw to get it out. He is taped on both sides. So you're going to want to make sure to remove that tape so he easily pops off. And it does say on the lid, it does show you how to unbox him. I don't know if you guys can see that really well. But once the tape is off and the screw is out, yep, there's two more screws in the back. So we gotta take care of those. So the screws came out really easy. I have a long fingernail, so I was just able to stick my fingernail in there. But even like a butter knife or something flat that's not going to cut you when you turn them, that would work really well in getting those out. And then the top just comes off. But he's still in here really good, guys. If you look on the bottom, there's these pieces of plastic that are holding the bottom on. So I'm trying to figure out the best way is probably to fold those little tabs, fold them in. And yes, I'm looking, there are instructions on the bottom of the box and I am doing it right. It says to fold those in. And when you fold those in, he's supposed to pull right out, but he does not. So he is fighting me this whole way. So let's see if I can get it a little bit better. And I finally got it off, guys. That was awful. It took me like 10 minutes to get this to actually behave correctly to come out of the box. But there he is. The plastic is off of him. I probably won't be putting him back in the plastic anyway. But, yep, plastic is off of him. And then there's little screws in the back here. You just undo those. And they pull out. They don't want you getting Mr. Stitchy out of the box. And then, in theory, he should pop right off. So this is really cool because you can use this to hang him back on when you're not playing with him. So his head will go on there back pretty much the way it was. So you have a nice display case for him. But let's forget the display case right now. Let's finally get to the stitch. How stinking cute is he, guys? <laughs> I love it. The hand fits right in the back here very, very easily. Adult hand fitting in there very nicely. So there's a little thumb part on the bottom where you make his mouth move. Switch hands here. I'm a lefty. <laughs> and then there's little eye things and ear things. Ah! So there's two tabs on the top where you put your hand in. 
this one on the right makes the eyes blink and you can do you know just semi or full and then the other side that tab makes the ears move now his hand is attached to his ear just because he's waving like hi we're gonna get rid of that oops I should have cut it but we're gonna get rid of that so we have just our regular stitch here now I said he makes noises but he does take batteries so inside his head there's a little battery compartment so grab a screwdriver and then once you get that off he takes three AAA batteries so we're gonna put those in there and see how he sounds I'm so excited so the batteries are in guys before I turn them on I do want to show you he does come with right now a first edition certificate of authenticity so gonna put that somewhere safe and he does come with directions the directions pretty much go over so far what I said about doing the batteries and everything it's got a little user's guide showing you all the different touch points and areas on him and then on the back it does have the batteries so on the little user's guy he's got ear levers eye levers mouth lever thumb rest another thumb rest touch sensor on off switch battery compartment no sensor tongue trigger all kinds of fun things to do with him how super fun is that so I don't think I think he's pretty self-explanatory his mouth is plastic he will have a tongue sensor there his teeth are plastic he will do stuff when you touch him and he has a nose sensor which is supposed to sense when things are near it so on the back here he does have a little on off switch you guys ready i'm so ready i haven't played with it yet i'm so ready oh, aloha <laughs> aloha stitch how are you buddy <laughs> So he just wants to keep talking. You're really cute. So what happens when we touch your head? Oh, he purrs. Ooh. <laughs> That's very, very cool. Oh! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> so... Oh. He's got a little nose sensor. <laughs> oh my god. Stitch, you're adorbs. <laughs> so he is so fun. I'm going to take my hand out of him for a minute just to show you that some of those sensors and things do work when you don't have your hand in there. So he will still purr. He will still sniff. I love it. <laughs> and we forgot to do his tongue sensor. Let's see, that's when nothing's in there. Put my hand in there. <laughs> oh! <laughs> So he will make yum yum noises when you close his mouth and put something in it, like your finger. Oh, he's, he's eating my finger! So my hard thing is when I shut him, I tend to hit his eyes. So it's going to take a little bit of work to get Stitch to work properly for me. But how stinking cute is he, guys? So his body is plush. So if you sit him down, his head's very heavy. He is just gonna kind of, that's why they have that hook in his little display case. Yes, really? Oh, I got makeup on your nose. I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> but all plush, very, very soft. And then the head is plastic because it has all the sensors and things in there. <laughs> so he hasn't said anything other than aloha in his regular English language. He's talking pretty much gib gibberish at this point. I wonder if there is 
Nope, it's just an on-off switch. There is no demo switch on him. But I think he's really, really super fun. Let's see if I can get him there. <laughs> and how cute is he with his little mouth closed? So I want to get... <laughs> so way, way too much fun, little dude. You are super cute. I love the sniffing action. That's awesome. You are going to be a fun addition. I am going to take him to Disneyland. Not this next time we go, but maybe the time after that. I wish I was going on 626 day because that would be really fun. Love his little feeties. Love his hands. Love his face. He does get a little heavy as he's holding, as you're holding on to him. So carrying him around like this all day is probably not something I'm going to do, but I do want to take him and get some fun pictures with him. Yes. Yes, and of course I'm going to play around with them more and get a little bit better at the eye movements and the sounds. Oh, I went to look at something and that was really cool, dude. <laughs> So we got a little yeehaw out of him. So I'm sure there's all kinds of sounds and things that I haven't figured out with him yet. But he's available now, guys. Well, kind of. He's available in the UK now, and he should be available in the US any day now. I think it's supposed to ship very, very soon, unless there's a delay. So in the US, you can get him on Amazon. I will put the link to that in the description of the video for you. Cost of him in the US is $79.99. In the UK, he's available at Smith's Toys, and I believe he's about 70 pounds over in the UK. But... <laughs> He's so cool. I love him. Maybe as I interact with him more, maybe we'll get some English. Yes. Anytime I get him near me, He's sniffing, and you know what? It's really hot in here, and I'm sweaty, so that's probably what you're smelling, dude. But he thinks it smells yummy. <laughs> but rating him on our scale of totally bad to totally rad, this is definitely a beyond totally rad, guys. We are going to have so much fun with this dude. <laughs> Total fun with you? Total fun with Stitch. What do you think of them, guys? Let me know in the comments below. And thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more awesome and totally rad things in the future, please subscribe to our channel and turn that notification bell on so you don't miss seeing us. <laughs> and I guess there's only one thing left to say, right, Stitch? We'll see ya later. He likes you guys.